OK, we've just been told to put our goggles on. The plane is descending fast. I think that's the signal we are about to go on board. Uh, this is the scary bit. OK, that's the signal. And we're down. These three super carriers now sailing in the Sea of Japan are carrying more than 200 combat aircraft. That's more than the size of most countries' air forces. It sends a very powerful political message to America's foes. Of course, one foe in particular. The significance of our combat power as a American supercarrier is our striking arm of our carrier air wing and we can sustain 24-hour operations for extended periods of time. Um, however, with more than one carrier, that length of time goes out indefinitely, quite frankly, when we get to three. Check out 101, see, uh, see what's going to put on the deck here, how much we got. Turning starboard, heel port, turning starboard, heel port. So this is one of the mess decks on the USS Ronald Reagan, and you can see how busy it is, and it's like this pretty much 24 hours a day. This is a ship, but it's got the population of a small town. There are 5,000 people on board the Reagan, and that means they have to make 18,000 meals a day. They have a nice 7,000 foot runway to land on. <laughs> Why would you choose to want to fly a plane and land on a, a four acres? Why would you not? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't, it was uh, a dream of mine to go naval aviation specifically for the carrier. Uh, landing on the boat both day and night is, is what it's all about.